you with another video. This time, I'm going to be telling you the story of how I got my name. Um, well, I don't remember how long ago it was, but it was a decent while. Man, I'm guessing, uh, if I had to guess, I would say over five years ago, maybe even over six. Um, it goes like this. I've always been a fan of Star Wars, and I do play video games, and my favorite type of video games tied with role-playing games would be real-time or turn-based strategy games. And there was a Star Wars game, which I love Star Wars, that was a, what happened to be, a mix of turn-based and real-time strategy. So it mixes some of my favorite genres or one of my favorite settings, and you know I'm, I have to go try this game out. So, it's called uh, Star Wars Empire at War, if anyone's interested in what game it was. I played so much of it on single player against AI. It took me forever to get good at it, because it was, this was a while back, and I wasn't very good at games way back then. But, eventually, you know, I stopped playing it for some time, and then come back to it, and I'm like, okay, I've gotten a lot better at this game. So, I'm like, alright, I'm going to go online. And it asked me what's going to be my username. Well, I never really had to make a username for anything besides for when just me and my friends are playing random stuff, like on the original Xbox and whatnot, I'd invite friends over to play that. And, you know, just random names, like nicknames we kind of gave ourselves. And I was like, okay, what's my username going to be? What's everybody in the world that I meet on this game going to call me? And with the help of one of my friends, we came up with the idea, Blaba the Hut. You know, like Jabba, but Blaba. I did prefer playing as the cartel on the gold edition uh, over the Empire of the Rebels. And, you know, that just kind of happened. And then when I moved on, and I was able to get Xbox Live for my Xbox 360, which this is when I was really big into video games. I kind of died off of them a lot recently, but I still play them time to time. But, so I was like, okay, I need a username for this. And I had the option of using my old name, my nickname, that I had with my friends, which was Deadeye because I always used to play sniper type characters and I always used to love being a sniper, always the ranged guy, the ranger, the and Dungeons and Dragons style stuff, the sniper and military things or futuristic things and all that good stuff. So that was my nickname back then. And then I, was, I had two usernames now and I was like, which one am I going to use? And once again, with the help of my friends, I decided on Blaba the Hut, which was how... Um, and then after many many mispronunciations later it turned into Blaba the Hut, which technically wouldn't be a mispronunciation now, I don't think, but instead of um it went from Blaba to Bloba the Hut and we just decided we all kinda just got along with calling it Bloba. Blaba Bloba. Like Dungeon Master Bloba. Bloba the Hut. You know, stuff like that. And then they kind of just stopped calling me by my real name, which is Atlan, by the way, for anybody who's interested. You can refer to me as Bloba, Blaba, Alan, whatever you want. I'll answer to anything. And, um, yeah, they just ended up stopped calling me by my real name for the most part and just started calling me Bloba. And it, it just stuck so heavily that I, when I made my YouTube account, I um, made it where there was... Maybe just to make sure I'm getting a good sound. But I made my YouTube account and it was HCGX Reaver. Yeah. That was when I was really big on video games and I was part, I founded my own little clan or gaming group for um, playing uh, shooter games on Xbox. Like I said, I've fallen, and that's when I made this YouTube channel, it was way, way back then. But I've fallen a lot away from video games, and when I really wanted to pick up my channel, I was like, you know what? I want to make, I like, I really, really like RPGs, so 
I'm going to change my name to Dungeon Master Bloba because I'm my group's Dungeon Master and everybody calls me Bloba, so Dungeon Master Bloba, that's how you get my YouTube name. And then we began the long journey to end up where I am now. Uh, Paul, I would also like to have a formal apology to all of you out there who have been loyal subscribers and I have had massive breaks in my videos. I've kind of had like a crisis with myself, like, okay, I'm done with tabletop games for a while and then I come back to them and then my channel suffers and you guys suffer and we all suffer and everything and it's just horrible, really moody and I've been really busy the past few days with my friends and family and whatnot. And so that's why I haven't been putting up a lot of videos but I got some free time now even though it's midnight but hey I thought I'd finally get this video made and um I want to tell you guys I'm not dead, not left again, and I am going to be putting up some new videos hopefully soon. I should pick up quite a bit here within the next few days. I have some video ideas already in my noggin for what's going to be next, and um, also I'm going to ask you guys a question in the next video, but I'm going to ask it here too, so that you get two questions. If you already hear it here, don't worry about watching the next video. but you for those of you who haven't seen my me and my friends live play of a game I will send a, put a link in the description to it we um got some decent criticism not necessarily criticism more like uh saying we we were we did good um but I know that the game that we were playing didn't really have a lot of good reception I know Andrew Wood hates it himself. He was the one who, one of the people who com he's the only person who commented on the YouTube video, but out that there were some people on Facebook who liked it and whatnot as well. And I know that he's not alone in his deep-seated hatred for the Hunter game. And I mean, the purpose of that video, really, the reason I picked Hunter above everything else, one is really easy to learn, and I know it pretty well. And I wanted to do. Um, a game, a less popular game, to show that even if you have a good group, you you can make even um, other games fun. Like people, games people don't really like, you can turn them fun. That's what the whole point of that video was. But I see a lot, a lot of people like it. Even if they like m myself and the group, they don't really like the game. So um, don't worry about my players. We will continue the game in private if nobody wants us to keep putting up videos. But I was thinking about asking you guys what do you want? Do you want me to um, put up more videos of us playing Hunter? Do you want us to play a different World of Darkness game? Do you want us to play Dungeons and Dragons? Or if you guys really want to, we could play my own game system that I made up that I hope to one day have refined and published enough that I can do something like Andrew did within the Ring of Fire and, you know, publish it into a game series. But that's a long way off, and we can show you guys like the, I don't know, I guess it would be the early, early alpha testings of it. I've been, and um, if you want, I can tell you the story of that game as well. But this is Dungeon Master Boba signing off. Till next time. Also, have a Merry, Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry, Merry Christmas.